<clears throat> so as the world descended into chaos, God stood from behind and watched the set of the world where she prefers to be, which is off set and back where she is more useful at correspondence spot where wherever she needed to, whoever she needed to meet with being famous scientist being whatever writer document tour for the whole world it was simple it was a call it was a port system and it worked really easily and fast before this telecommunications problem uh, arose that I said you weren't allowed to have. Um, there, have you ever heard of Attila the Hun? A-T-T-I-L-A. -T the Hun. H-U-N. It's also the Han. H-A-N. Um, for my Germanic. Uh, what happens is there's several different empires. <clears throat> The Holy Roman woman is in charge of it all. The Holy Catholic, the Caesar, the Caesar, the Caesar, the Zarina. Uh, then they call it the Jaguar priest. It depends on what empire we are talking of. Depends on the amount of chaos you are descending in is how many words I need to describe myself and to whom a light bulb flashes off. But it is all one and the same. All one mighty God that has many names. One face. Game of Thrones, they said, it is the many-faced gods. No, it is the one face of God. It is the many face of the catalog of man that has been deleted. Or, it is the catalog of men that could be useful if they weren't programmed wrong, like Lewis. He's an iota, without a cosmic egg. He was an electron pr transporter and brought in. See, I go, my set direct, where I was trying to fix, went from 1911, from Antonine Cataruzza. In Italy, Holy Roman Empire, Alonso, by the... I just spoke to a Romanian. He's like, you mean uh, your grandfather was uh, Caesar for Albania? And I was like, actually, yes. I was like, why, you've heard of such things? He goes, yes, I have. I said, okay, thank you. One human on the face of the earth that's heard of such things in America. Um, he bought me coffee just now. The gentleman around the corner, really nice guy. He's a Romanian. Um, so, um, I said, uh, I said, I'm, I'm like Dracula, I said, I'm like a vampire, I said, because he invited me to the beach, and I said, no, I'm not big on the sun, I'll go with my, my, my children, but I said, um, have you ever heard of Julius Caesar and, um, Augustus, what, uh, in the Holy Roman Empire? He said, yeah. I said, yeah. I said, but I'm the bloodline of... And he goes, oh, and that's why he says, wait a minute, you're, I said, my grandfather came from that area. And he said, wait a minute, you mean uh, like Albania? Yeah. Okay, so, back to where I was with time and placement. Okay, so I go from 1910 to Alexander the Great returning as an immaculate conception for the Holy Catholic. They say it's a Mari. Uh, Mari is a uh, high priestess, uh, if you speak Torah, I believe. Uh, they can uh, attest to that. Um, and there's, uh, right, the Constantinople is the relationship between my Niklaus and myself and our son Alexander. But Alexander comes as an immaculate conception to me, either way, in 2005. So we go from set date of Antonine Caesar in Italy, uh, being 1910-1911, to um, Alexander the Great in 2005. And depending on where the Immaculate Alexander the Great is born, um, again in history, um, 
is where the flag and the partner of the goddess uh, is uh, a problem in, in if I am in this set where M29 uh, to Alexander the Great in 2005 is with Niklaus, um, I believe it's Niklaus Hitler, we said he's my Constantinople, um, he is in parallel status already and as well, uh, and tonight was, I guess, deleted out of history. I don't know how you can delete someone out of history, but they did. And so when you're a god, no less, and a god carrier. So Niklaus and I had the same meeting that I said before as the war horse um, for the 15 minute and 30 second. Uh, I'm sorry, 30, 33 minute and something. Um, I couldn't put an Instagram museum on YouTube. I did the whole thing where I was sitting there and there was a Mike Houston, I called him Hungry Eyes. Um, he was uh, a direction where Alexander was going to be born wrong. So if Mr. Hungry Eyes, which is the protest church in, of England, sending in one of their guys and their Americans, uh, to witness the same conversation. I had the same conversation, but without the witness of God as the protesting of the God. Uh, I was also had with papers. Uh, Niklaus and I sat with M29 and said, we already know that you were deleted out of history. You should have been born a great Caesar and in the royal house. Uh, we are trying to reestablish your Italian royal heritage and royal house for your gra future granddaughter. Do you know how we can do such a things, right? And Hitler sat next to me. That was Niklaus Hitler, um, my future husband. But we were correspondents. I think we said that we were the other side. We were, we were working for Crown Royale in uh, cultivating the information that the live uh, ninth born 1911 Antonine, uh, what his understanding was, what his family told him, which was nothing. A couple of the gentlemen that he was um, in service with, so this way he does not sound crazy and he has God's witnesses as Caesar because a lot of enemies like come up throughout history. I don't know why they challenge things that are so, but whatever, I come from a, a godly place and understanding where we don't take advantage of just anybody. Uh, all right, so uh, here we are in uh, Niklaus, and I also had an image, but he had papers, and I had to keep referencing to him uh, because uh, he spoke Italian and Latin, I believe, or something I don't know in Yugoslavia, maybe, well I know he's Aus uh, Austrian, so perhaps one of the gentlemen from Yugoslavia or Albania spoke Niklaus. So um, I sat quiet and then I just interjected when I had a question and he translated to Latin English for me. Uh, so we had one speak in that conversation. So we would get our son Alexander, the uh, 2005 Alexander, uh, born properly between the two of us as Zarina, uh, the Polish Zarina, uh, spelling for the Cesar in um, Italy, the Holy Roman Empire, the Catholics, for Cataluza, who was having the Immaculate in 2005. And Nicholas was there as himself uh, on our behalf as the male with documentation, and he spoke more language than I did. That's always how that is. So uh, the only time that he got removed was when they replaced him with the Michael Cusan, which was the Holy Protest Church of England, because he's got some Scottish whatever, and he's an American whatever. Uh, but he was my witness that the, 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 if he arrives with hungry eyes and I'm just single without Niklaus, there's a very big problem. And I don't know how to fix. How do you fix this when you erase one of the royals out of the most important royal seat in all of history. How do you get them back in? What the fuck are you all doing? 